Good morning, dear students. Welcome back to our science class, chapter 2, Components of Food, part 5. Before proceeding, I would like to remind you to subscribe my channel for further notifications. The last class we discussed and studied about the diseases caused by the lack of vitamins or deficiency diseases like night blindness, beriberi, scurvy, rickets, etc. Hope you all understood well. If any doubt, please mention it in the comment box. Then let us continue our new topic. That is diseases due to the deficiency of minerals. The next nutrient minerals. We studied that vitamins and minerals are protective food. Why? Because it protects us from diseases and keeps us healthy. But we need these two in small quantities. Rich sources of minerals are milk, cheese, green leafy vegetables, pulses, meat, egg. Then some important minerals are very essential to our body like iodine, iron, phosphorus, calcium, etc. Then what will happen? Our food not containing these essential minerals. Then some problem will come. Lack of iodine in our food. We are not including proper iodine in our food. One disease will come. The disease name is goiter. What is goiter? Swelling of the neck. Swollen gland in the neck. One gland is present in the neck. Thyroid gland. It is producing one hormone. That is thyroxin. For the production of thyroxin. Iodine is very very important. Then how we can prevent this disease? By taking food like iodized salt. Sea fish. Sea weeds. Onion etc. Second mineral, iron. The lack of iron in our food, one disease will come. That is anemia. What is anemia? Lack of blood. That means lack of RBC, red blood cells in our blood. Then, weakness, pale appearance, energy level is going down. How we can prevent this disease? By taking food like green leafy vegetables, meat, liver, egg, fish, nuts, etc. Next one, phosphorus. Phosphorus not taking in proper amount, weak and soft to bones will come. Otherwise we can say rickets. We studied rickets, the lack of vitamin D. We have to take food like Milk, cheese, pulses, fish, meat, cereals, etc. Next is calcium. Calcium also very important. It causes that the lack of calcium in our food. We can soft to bones will come rickets we can say. We have to take food like milk, cheese, curd, fish, egg, cabbage, and dark green leafy vegetables. This calcium and phosphorus build our bones and teeth or strong bones and teeth we will get after including proper amount of calcium and phosphorus. Then write down these questions. Name the following. A. Two minerals required for strong bones and teeth. B. Disease caused by the deficiency of iodine. Thank you. Have a nice day.